So, as you probably know, if you follow me on Twitter or if you've been to any of my live streams, the videos that you've seen over the past few days have been fa in fact scheduled. I really started there. That's not good. I've been gone from Friday, like Friday after an exam in early afternoon, till just about now. I've literally got out, got back within the hour, and here we are. And I it is my knowledge. It is to my knowledge. Fucking shit. I need to really, really, really think about what I say before I start doing things. But I can't be bothered. I want to do it this way. I'm never gonna change. Fuck you, you, and you. So on Friday, literally minutes, minutes, literally minutes after we departed, they revealed the Far Cry 5 reveal trailer, and I actually haven't yet taken a look at it, so I reckon together we're going to break it down as we go along, we're going to have a look, see what's going on. I'm late to this, I'm so sorry, but I wanted to do it because I don't want to lose out on this opportunity to not be forcing Assassin's Creed content, because as long as that's alright, everyone's happy, but... I would be much happier if my videos weren't all based on Assassin's Creed, if you know. So I'm going to seize this opportunity, backtrack a little bit, a couple of days. It's not like I've been gone for years. And we're going to take a look at this. So here we are. Let's give it a good old watch. Sorry, I looked out my window then for some reason. I'm clearly handicapped. I know it's not quite how it is, but we're on the Ubisoft US site, which is why it's just making 10 content inappropriate for children and not the... Peggy 18 that you might be used to if you're like me and you're from the United Kingdom. That's what I'm used to so You know, let's give it a watch shall we and then afterwards. We're gonna break it down uh, Sinner something what what naked guy in the street guy being dragged What's going on there something It's a bit laggy is coming. I think that's because my PC's shit, but, but again, I don't know There's private property. There's some cat those cows look really nice next-gen cows everybody Where's it at? Welcome fans, so sport, there's a nice car, some people with guns on the top, that's lovely, you know, always have them in my town. General store, it's nice, is this in-game, or is this like, uh, is this like rendered in engine, or what is it? Because it's definitely in some form of graphical engine, so it's probably, re ooh, that, that symbol, that symbol's nice, but this is quite, quite, oh, no, please don't kill him, yes, kill him. Don't know what they're doing. Making sacrifices to their squid god. Baptisms. Very extreme Christian cult going on, and this is their symbol. What does it mean? That I don't know. I don't know. Just, just, just I'm... who's that? Who's that? I don't know. There's a plane there. So the planes. This guy is greed. Don't know what that means. I think everybody's a bit zealous, religiously speaking here. Oh dear, I don't know what I'm looking at really, but I like the plane, to be honest, and the cows again, next gen cows, um, bear, get attacked by a bear, something going on there, there's a lot of the same stuff that we've seen over and over, then it's back to this religious cult church, that's probably the main villain, Sinner Hope County, it just says Sinner, it just says Sinner, right? I don't know why, it's like saying Bovril, for no reason, so, yeah, that, that's, that's the, that's, that's the trailer, it's time to take a look. Now, down here it actually says it's in-game engine footage, not game footage. So the game's going to look a little different, but it's visually similar. Now, the trailer reveals Far Cry 5 with the title like we have seen beforehand. So it's nothing new, but the trailer gives us in-engine footage so we have a rough idea of what the game's going to look like. The cows look lovely. Those next-gen cows, I just, I just want a next-gen cow, really. Beyond that, we see some nice visuals of Hope County, Montana, I believe. And it, also, it said Sinner on the, the welcome sign, which I found quite funny. As you can tell from the cars that you see in the trailer, you know that it's confirmed to be a modern setting, modern Hope County, Montana, not Wild West, that's bollocks. So we see that silly cross thing with the six, eight points, is it, all over the place, and it's quite clearly an extreme Christian cult. Now this is very interesting as it actually upset a lot of Christians, and to be honest, that's, that's a little funny, to be honest. All I personally have to say about that is Far Cry 5 is a game, it's meant for entertainment, not as religious or political propaganda, so calm yourselves. Now here we see the villain at the front supposedly in the trailer, now 
What I think about this is you can't really judge a character based on how they're introduced in a tra trailer because I've seen many characters be like be introduced in a trailer in a way that they're not portrayed in the game. Like in the trailer they say certain lines that are somewhat out of character maybe. Sometimes they say lines that they do say in the games but it doesn't the full sentence and that's probably something that's going on here. So we don't actually get to know the main antagonist much but I'd wager that this guy here at the front is the main villain in Far Cry 5. But, from what we can gather, very strong believing Christian cult as opposed to just Christians as they're going around killing people and they're essentially just spreading fear in Hope County, Montana. Also, with planes on the cover art and in the trailer where we see some planes flying, it gives the impression that we might actually see some aerial gameplay, if not a mission where we're in the sky, maybe just planes that we can get into and fly around in, that'll be really cool. Though, please bear in mind I haven't read any articles, I'm just going off what the trailer's telling me. But Ubisoft's biggest selling point here is definitely these next-gen cows. And also, in this trailer we witness what looks like somebody having a really bad day. And the trailer finishes off how it started. Now it was just a reveal to give us a feel for the world of Hope County, Montana. That felt weird to say, but that's what they're doing. And it's the typical Far Cry setting just in America. What we got here is a beautiful scene. We've got Hope County, it's gorgeous in what we've seen in this trailer being terrorized by some organization in this case a christian cult of people killing thy neighbor obviously the eight point cross is their symbol their insignia so to speak and apparently they're a very violent group of christians that love killing people or something along with that there are some just screenshots showing the world or the concept art i don't know quite which one they are I'd, rec I'd wager probably concept art, target render sort of stuff, maybe gameplay screenshots. But in the images we see Hope County, Montana, in its glory, looking lovely, being terrorised by Christians. Or at least a cultist branch of them, and honestly it looks quite lovely. Hopefully the game looks something like this. There were also separate trailers introducing us to Mary May, Pastor Jerome, and some guy called Nick Rye. Nick Rye is the guy with the planes, Pastor Jerome is a pastor, obviously, and this Mary May character is a bartender by the looks of things. It's highly likely that these three characters will have a major significance in the narrative of Far Cry 5, and they'll help you on your quest to defeat the evil dude, whatever his name is. But in the meantime, is anyone else feeling an urge to crash this plane? But there you have it everybody, we know what Ubisoft do, they'll drop loads and loads and loads of trailers, and they'll milk it, they'll give us loads of information, fair enough, there's a lot to dive through. I had no intention of covering it all, I just wanted to get a video out on the full reveal because I haven't actually done one, it's been four days, I think it was high time that I got around to doing one. But thanks for watching guys, hope you enjoyed, be sure to go ahead, leave a like, subscribe, share, comment, let your friends know about this channel, and I'll see you all in the next one with another video, so yeah. So yeah.